Tonight, the word equity is the heart of public scrutiny for one state leader. Now, some local lawmakers are questioning whether the chief diversity officer is fit for his job. Alex Little Hales explains. With that, they're totally misguided. He totally misunderstands what the goal of equity programs are. In a newly penned letter, Virginia House Minority Leader Portsmouth Delegate Don Scott is putting a spotlight on Virginia's Chief Diversity Officer Martin Brown. First thing we're going to do is remove divisive concepts. Lawmakers passed a bill in 2020 creating Martin's position titled the Director of Diversity, Equity and Inclusion. But on the state government's official website, equity is now replaced with opportunity. This April, Brown commented on the change. This governor has a different philosophy of civil discourse. BI is dead. This change now draws criticism from the Virginia Legislative Black Caucus and the state's NAACP, who are calling for Brown to resign. I think this is a way for the governor and his folks to continue to try to divide us. When you talk about equity, it's talking about how do we put everybody, regardless of race, regardless of gender, in the best position to succeed. In a new letter to Attorney General Jason Miares, Delegate Scott wants the AG's opinion on whether Brown is violating his own job duties and Virginia code. Changing the nomenclature, he's, ch he's basically saying, I'm not going to do the duties within the statute that I'm mandated by law to do. In Portsmouth, Alex Little Hales for 13 News Now. The Yunkin administration responded to the concerns. A spokesperson from the governor's office said the governor will, quote, continue to advance equal opportunities, not equal outcomes for all Virginians, and called this a last-ditch attempt by Democrats to complain.